I got poop. And like you said, I'm, that, that's not me, you know, being an asshole. That's just, you know, it's, it's coming from us as a government entity and a government agency. And then you working here and then writing a paper bashing the government. I wouldn't say I'm bashing the government. About, We're just talking about the wage there. The, the wage is being low right now. Specifically about your wages here being low. I'm not even going to bring up my wages here. Yeah, but I mean, it's it's all going to be just, it's a bash article. Like, I'm not telling That's you. That's no not your legs. I'm not telling you any of that, but I'm telling you if the paper gets written, I'm taking it as a letter of resignation. No, I hear you. So, I don't want that to become anything that's between the friendship we've built. Oh, I won't. You've been. I know how to um, separate life from fantasy. And, and so do I. You know, that's that's one thing I've uh, gathered over the years, that business is business, personal is personal. Sometimes you mix a little business with personal, and sometimes you mix a little personal with business, and typically when you start mixing it too much, it doesn't work out. Um... As long as both people can keep that mindset that business is business, personal is personal. Excuse me. No, yeah, no, I learned the hard way when I was like 21 about that. So it's one of those lessons you kind of got to learn the hard way. Oh, yeah. Yep. Especially like, like, like I work for a company where, you know, I, it was my first time being in like a management position. And the guy that was one of my best friends there ended up turning on me and making up lies about me to get people to go against me. And it just was not a fun time. And it ruined a lot of friendships. That's, yeah. I've seen it too many times. So now I learn when I, when I go to work and I'm clocking in for a job, I'm, I'm just there to, uh, um, I'm just there to uh, collect the paycheck and go home, you know? And, and it's more than that, too. Oh, yeah. But, you know what I mean? Like, I, I agree. You, know, there, you have to have at least some of that mindset or it's going to end up turning into a shit show. My thing is, <laughs> I don't care if somebody wants to come to me and talk to me about anything. Leave your bullshit at the door. You know exactly. I, mean? like, I don't care if you talk to me about your bullshit, but don't bring it into work to you and let it affect your work. So, um, I guess that's, that's where I stand with it. Um, like I said, I don't, uh, I don't want to see anything. <laughs> I didn't say bare legs. I meant like bear. Um, should be dealt with. On any level, let alone coming from a DOT employee. I'm made up out of... No. Those aren't the same either, Benji. No, I feel it. I understand what you're saying. So, but I guess at that point, um, at least have the courtesy to give me a heads up. If that's what you decide you're going to do. Well, I will. Uh -huh. Like, I'm not, I'm not going to print anything until there's more of a story there. Um, I know Sergio told me he wanted to, like, like, like he'd be down to talk about it, too, so. Am I allowed to be part of this converse, uh, convo? That's up to him. I don't care. Okay. But her name is Iceberg. Yeah. Just for something to do. So... Yeah, nope. I uh I don't wanna I don't wanna be in it, don't wanna be in the drama with it. I don't wanna have any of it and I don't want DOT in at all. 